And although coffee is still enjoyed in many domestic rituals, Turkish men come to prefer the public coffee houses. There's also resistance to the exotic new beverage. For some reason, coffee arrived in Europe with negative connotations about it. It was almost as if there was an advance warning coming. Something bad is coming, which everybody's going to like. The Turkish men went to coffee houses where they drank coffee without women. They also went to bathhouses without women. And some of the Turkish regiments had homosexuals in them. And consequently, the connection of coffee as the Turks drink meant that there was an association that coffee made you effeminate. And that was an attitude that was brought over to Venice. 